What's up, guys? I have not updated you in a while. I think my last um, update was about th sorry, three weeks out, um, and I'm currently 11 days out. It's October 23rd, Tuesday. Um, I talked to my coach yesterday and weighed in today, and he increased my steady state by five minutes. So now I'm going to be doing 50 minutes of steady state cardio after my workouts. And he said to increase it for by five minutes for the next three days. But today was back day, tomorrow's chest day, and then I have a leg day, and I don't normally do cardio after leg day. I just do it after my upper body days. But I'm gonna do it, because he said the next three days, and we're like, because then we'll be like one week out, and it, that's crazy. So I'm just gonna kill it. That'll be interesting. I'll probably have extra carbs that morning. Not too much though, because I don't want to feel dragging. So I have some news. I binged on my refeed day, which was Friday, and today's Tuesday, like I said. Um, I don't know, like I am a little bit PMS-y. I'm supposed to be having my period soon. And then it's like my emotional week, and I, I got to the point where I was just like, I don't give an F about you know, whatever, like I'm already lean, doesn't matter, it's not good, whatever, you know, just like it's refeed anyways, I'll just eat more. And part of the reason why I binged is because we were booing people in the neighborhood, booing, you know, like sending, giving them gifts and knocking on their door and running away. Um, so by gifts, I mean baking, <laughs> baked goods. <laughs> I ate a few cookies, got my carbs in that way on top of, you know, the rest of the day, um, ate some cookie dough. I just get to that point where I'm just like, whatever, but it's a really bad attitude to have because even like, cause I get, I feel confident and then I don't feel confident. So it just depends on like the day. But um, I'm like, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't in it to win my class and then to compete in overalls and hopefully win overalls because it's just, I, I know it's not like necessarily realistic to think that I would do that because the judging, you just never know about the judges, you never know about like what girls are going to be in your class or if I do make it to overall, um, if like girls are going to be like just bringing a better package than me um, and that happens, hello, obviously. Um, so you don't want to like look back and have regrets and be like, oh, you thought you were good, but you didn't win, you know? Um, and the reason why I'm setting the standards higher this time, because before it was just like, I just want to place, you know, I just want first call outs or whatever. But um, my first competition, I placed fifth, which was like shocker because it was my first competition and I um, trained myself <clears throat> and I was just like barely, you know, getting into everything. And then my second competition, I placed fourth, which was like, oh, yay, I bumped up one, you know? And I looked, um, actually, yeah, I looked a little better, but I was still pretty soft, and I trained myself. And then my third competition, I placed first out of two girls, but nonetheless, it's just kind of nice that it went from five, four, one. And then, so, again, I'd want first place. I don't want to, like, go down in rank or whatever, even though it's not, like, the same set of girls, same panel, whatever. So it's just fun to like have your progress be manifested in your placing. I've been lucky enough to have that be the case so far, but it's not realistic to think that that's gonna continue. That's boring. So we have to get through this show first and actually place well before I would even consider that. Um, so I wanted to show you guys, I'm obviously sitting in front of my computer screen, just kind of recap. So. What we have here is, I think you probably saw, um, actually you haven't seen that yet, I don't think. So I think you saw this last time, um, and it looks like he had increased my steady state by five minutes, because you see here it is 40 minutes, and this is 45, and actually, yeah, 45, and then this is actually 50, to, wait. This delts was 45, today is back day, and it's 50. So I'll put that in there. Um, you can see that I was 116 that Friday, 115.8. Um, I went down, what is that, 0.6 pounds for both, yeah, for both. 
and then I dropped just point two between the two Fridays and that's why I was like, you're gonna drop me, right? But he didn't, which is fine. He made a good choice. And then I was just still just wanting to cut. Like this is why I don't like training myself because I would probably cut too hard and then go back and whatever, just because I'm crazy about myself. Um, not about my clients, that's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> it's easier when you have a client that's not your body. So, but my weekly average was down by 0.6 pounds even though my Friday average or Friday weight was just down by 0.2. So that shows some progress and also, if you look at my measurements, um, my waist dropped by 0.25, my hips were the same, my glutes went down 0.25, my thighs went down point, like a half an inch. So, um, yeah. And then this was my screw up refeed that I tried to log as best I could. This was supposed to be like 2.30, I think, carbs, but I went like over by almost 100. This was supposed to be 45. Um, yeah, and as you can see, my fiber's getting low, starting to get low. Just bad choices and carbs and stuff. I should be eating more beans and fibrous things. So, I had a new low this Friday, only 0.2, then I gained two pounds, then it dropped. Is that today? That was yesterday. That was yesterday. So that was a new low, and then today was 114.8, I'm pretty sure. So if you look at my average already, it's dropped 0.4 pounds, which is cool. All right guys, it's that time again. Today, I've got chocolate on my lip, is Friday, October 27th. We are eight days out from the Sean Ray Hawaiian Classic, the first of its kind here on the island. Um, and I just wanted to show you my Excel sheet and finish up the week. So, I forget when I checked in last a few days ago, but my average weight's 115.3. Last week it was 116.3, so I lost a whole pound. Friday weight, uh, I lost a pound, 1.2 pounds between Friday weights. I checked in with my coach yesterday, so he hasn't even seen today. Um, here I talked to him on heavy leg day and he was like do 50 minute session for the next three days so I did but I didn't want to do it that day because it's leg day so I did it on this day my knee was hurting so this day is kind of funky but it's all right he hasn't changed my macros yet I get my plan today if he's on it um, I am refeed today so these are my macros for today and my measurements were the same as last week but that's okay um, I'm recovering a little bit faster as far as my weight after refeed and this is peak week. Peak week starts tomorrow so I'm pretty excited. I had a light hit, very light core workout because it hurts my back and I know there's exercises I can do that are better than others but still it hurts my back. Okay, I'm not trying to get hurt before the show and um, did a little bit of steady state, not too much and then I did posing which I will show you. So um, just some other things that uh, are happening is that the salon next to my gym is brand new. And um, I guess there's only three girls on the island that do a specific type of extensions, hair extensions. And I had gone in there to ask them just for like a cleanup because I wasn't gonna do extensions because sometimes they don't look very good and yeah but they offered to sponsor me and do my hair and then I was like okay but just so you know I'm gonna diet like today and I'm gonna diet black I already have the stuff and they're like well do you use professional product yes I do I go to Sally's I get the stuff I mix it up myself and everything but she was like we'll just do it so they're gonna dye my hair and put extensions in it and that's gonna happen on Thursday super excited about it I hope they look good and they're not like too much because that'll be hard for me to deal with so I'm definitely gonna practice posing with the new hair um, and hopefully it looks good um, I might have to have somebody do my hair we'll see I'm gonna play with it and see if I can just do it straight because I don't know if I can curl it good and I don't want to mess with it too much so that's exciting um, tomorrow's Saturday 
I have shoulder workout. Well, I don't know. I, I don't know my plan. I don't know if he's gonna have me just do my regular workouts or not, so I'm gonna wait on that. I'll let you know. I'll have like a peak week video. Um, and then, so, but I do know that Sunday at nine o'clock I get my nails done, lashes on Wednesday, hair on Thursday, tan and meeting Friday, show on Saturday. It's just, I'm so excited. And my parents come on Sunday, so this week is just gonna fly by. Plus I have my daughter's birthday and preparation for all that. <sighs> so excited. So anyways, I will see you next video. Will be my peak week video. Maybe I'll try and get some video. I don't know. I'll try and get it out as soon as I can. Okay, deal? Thanks, bye.